December to remember. जब हर साल शुरू होता है मी एंड प्राकृति सेट डाउन टूगेदर एंड वी मेक अ लिस्ट ऑफ थिंग्स डेट ये करना है ये करना है ये करना है ये तो डेफिनेटली करना है यू नो कमिंग बैक एंड लुकिंग बैक एट टू थाउजेंड एंड ट्वेंटी टू आई डोंट थिंक दैज अ बेटर वे टू एन द यर बादशाह हैज़ बिन समबडी दैट वी बिन वॉन्टिंग टू डू अ कोलेबरेशन विद इतने सालों से एंड आई एम सो हैप्पी इट्स कम थ्रू विद क्या से सो थैंक यू सो मच Well, I think the experience for us has been more of like a learning experience than anything else. Because everything that you see in the video is also a first for us. Um, I remember saying this to um, you know our director Amit, who's from Kerala. He shot some of the biggest South Indian music videos, and uh, you know the whole team was so new for us. And I remember seeing the footage on the monitors and saying that एक तो आवाज पहचान में नहीं आ रही ऊपर से ये लुक पहचान में नहीं आ रही गाना किसका है because the whole transformation has been so real uh, we've tried to be very true to the song um, you know the composer of the song chamath who has also composed mani ke mage hite that sri lankan flavor had to come through sri lanka nahi ja paaye to hum kerala chale gaye but we've tried to keep that flavor as much and uh, you know it's getting so much love everyone is seeing the video and saying that it looks like um, an absolute visual delight and you know the song is sticking with them bahut hooky lag raha hai unko song and um, बहुत लोगों से हम नहीं मिल पाए बिकॉज वी बिन वेरी पैक टू द वर्क बट जितने भी लोगों से मिल पाए इंडस्ट्री से आई थिंक दे बिन सेंग सच अमेजिंग थिंग्स अबाउट द सॉन्ग एंड या इट्स जस्ट बिगान डिसम्बर नॉट ओवर यार Yeah. Like a holiday really. Yeah, I hundred percent. I think uh, there were so many moments during the shoot. एक तो actually the most interesting part was that हर location मतलब ऐसा नहीं कि दो location है तीन location there are lot of different different locations. Every location के लिए we had to do a little bit of a trek for फिफ्टीन minutes with the Ghagra and the hair and the makeup सब पकड़ के and no shoes. पहला video जिसमें हमने जूते ही नहीं पहने क्योंकि पहनते तो खराब हो जाते हमारे आउटफिट्स भी खराब हो गए थे बट द होल एक्सपीरियंस हैज बिन सो ब्यूटीफुल देर आर टाइम्स वेयर यू नो द सन वॉज सेटिंग एंड वी वर यू नो मतलब सच ब्यूटिफुल लैंडस्केप एंड रॉक्स एंड पूरा डेंस फॉरेस्ट था यू नो सो फर्स्ट तो दे से देर इज गोन बी लाइक अ लॉर्ड ऑफ यू डोट नो हुज कमिंग देर कुड बी वाइल्ड एलिफेंट्स देर कुड बी वाइल्ड एनिमल्स एंड यू नो इंसेक्ट्स पूरी आधी क्रू को तो मतलब खून निकल रहा था बिकॉज एवर इज लीचेज गेटिंग स्टक ऑन एवरी वन You know, feet, uh, feet. and so, उनको निकालने के लिए like it was crazy, but I think also hats off to Bacha, जो उन्होंने किया है मतलब when you see the footage, I have we've all personally you know there's a whole team like taking him in the middle of the waterfall, वो rocks पे चढ़ के tree की log पे चढ़ के उन्होंने क्या नहीं किया है तो मतलब बहुत मजा आया है and it's always going to be an amazing experience that uh, would be very close to our hearts. I think we, you know, Sukriti and I, every time we are looking at making a song or you know uh, composing it from the start, या फिर अगर हम किसी के साथ collaborate करते हैं, the whole idea is to always kind of do something new. Of course, हम बहुत लोगों से inspire भी हैं, but I mean at the same time, the whole idea is कि हम ऐसा कुछ क्या कर कुछ कर सकते हैं जो दूसरे सॉन्ग से थोड़ा डिफरेंट है एंड आई फील लाइक व्हेन आई हॉट क्या से द होल जर्नी ऑफ क्या से हैज बिन अ ईयर लॉन्ग 
I still remember when Jugnu released. <laughs> we met Bacha. Uh, we went for a little drive, and uh, you know he's always been that support system for us, where we play him all our music. This and he always tells us that ye mat karo, is pe kam karo, ye nahi karo. So you know it was that kind of a thing, and we played him. So Chamath, who's made the song, he had sent me a draft of kya se, and wo apni hi language me uh, sehali. Sri Lankan language. Yes, Me, haan, sorry. <laughs> Unme, wo kuch aise bol bol ke unne kya se apne aap hi gaya tha. Kya se ka matlab kuch nahi tha. But gaane aise hi bante. Jab aap compose karte ho, tab Hindi English samajh nahi aata. Kuch bol aise bolte ho, jo it just sticks through. And of course, he doesn't know Hindi. So, wo jo unne hook me kya se kya se gaya tha ya kaise kaise gaya tha. And uh, we played a batch and we were just like, you know, this is really cool. This is something we really want to work on. Kuch alag hai and exciting hai kyunki aisa kuch bahut times humne suna nahi hai. So he was just like, yaar, ye tumhe karna chahiye. Little did we know at that time that he will, you know, write the song yeah. and feature in it. But uh, the best decision, I think, of this entire thing is that he really got stuck on that kya se. <laughs> because it's just different. I mean, the whole song talks about, now he's made a story for it. But the whole idea is like, say what? And there's... Two words ka hook which is very different Absolutely. and new. Viral ke saath aapki journey beautiful beautiful Tell us something about that. Well, I think Viral Originals has been our music family for a very long time. Um, from the start, I think when we started non-film music, uh, karna shuru kiya hai, they have been uh, you know, our biggest support system. And the first song we did with them was in 2019 uh, called Mafia. And from then to now, I think it's our 10th single with them. Uh, and I think the journey will continue. It's been a beautiful one. They have an amazing team. Um, everybody is so amazing. And I feel like when uh, their vision and our vision is the same, hota hai, that's, that's what you need in a label. And they've been very, very supportive. And there's a lot of exciting stuff that's coming up. Uh, shoot me, jo, uh, abhi aapne baat ki elephants, white animals. Yeah. <laughs> so there is Lakshmi also played a very major role yes, in that. Yes, 100%. Tell us about, uh, yeah, the elephant and Lakshmi. Well, I don't know. I think for me and Prakriti, for the longest time, if someone asked me, what is your favorite animal? I would always say elephant. Because they've always, you know, elephants are very emotional, very intelligent, very and very maternal also. Yeah, very maternal. You know, and extremely sensitive. And we knew this, but obviously, one of them is the elephant. He is a very beloved elephant. His name is Kali Das. I feel like he's a real star of the video. And he's in Bahubali and a Guys, lot of other movies. He's, he's, a, elephant, okay? he's so, a real celebrity. <laughs> already, we were like, like, and you know, it's a very big deal. Because where we have shot, there are Pushpa and Bahubali. And you, you know, these are movies already uh, shoot. Ho chuki hai, but the elephant in those caves mein wapis, after saat, three, four, saat saal saat ke baad. Saal. So where I, in the forest, the, no elephants were allowed. So for, the jinx was broken with this music video where the elephant came back in the forest after seven years. But uh, and I also, think... You know, uh, Kalidas uh, <laughs> blessed us also very beautifully. We had a reel on Instagram and I had no idea. Uh, it, it was just you know, a feeling we can't really describe because it was just the best blessing on the set of a song. But he has a full schedule. Matlab, 3 o'clock he comes to the shoot, then 3 to 5 he will eat, then he will nap for 2 hours. So. Then it's a shower time, bathing <laughs> time. So, you know, sir star. Hai. Yeah, so we had to go according to him, but anything for him. I think getting on top of that elephant, elephant. was the scariest part. That too in a sari, but I was... I was not and Suku was like, <laughs> 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 uh, you know, getting the song and sharing it with students, you know, there's so much good vibe going yeah. on. You've been traveling all over. Yeah. Aap yaha hai, college mein, what would you like to say? I think it's so amazing and nostalgic even for us because uh, we were in Mithi Bhai which is right opposite uh, and we were there for our junior college and we were just in the car coming and I was just like, Prakriti, get off your phone, just look around, where are we? Because we spend, I think, our best memories, you know, just being here and we used to work for the college fest too. Uh, so it, it, I think it's beautiful and we just love meeting people and, uh, you know, sharing our journey and sharing our music. I think that's, that's the best feeling ever. She's a fab, yeah. Sorry, 
<laughs> what can we pose when we are standing together <laughs> with our favorite host? <laughs> I don't congratulate Karo Zuku go. Karo 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 Pathan me title track a raha hai. Karo Gyara Baja Raja 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 चलो रोलिंग रोलिंग चलो रोल बस ये सर तो लम्बा हाथ मारो ठीक है ठीक है कल ग्यारह बजे मतलब मैं तो आठ बजे हो जाऊँगी पर I'm very very excited I think हर सिंगर का dream होता है कि एक दिन I have a song for Shah Rukh Khan and I feel like it's my first song actually with Vishal and Shekhar so I'm very excited, I haven't seen the video, I've sung a song for a year ago actually so I remember a little bit but you all will love it, I think this is the Shah Rukh Khan song because it's a title track the song is called Jhumay Jho Pathan so I'm very excited and I think it's going to be the first time I'm singing for Dipika and Vishal Khan 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 my favorite and the one and only Arijit Singh. So yeah, very nice. And you know, आह आप दोनों ही सिस्टर के गाने बहुत ही पसंद आते हैं। लेकिन ये कितना बड़ा मोमेंट है आप लोग के लिए एंड सेलिब्रेशन के लिए कितना रेडी हैं आप दोनों से। I think मुझसे ज़्यादा एक्साइटेड मेरे डैड हैं आज। So in fact, he's very active on Twitter and everything. उन्होंने actually सुबह सुबह देखा और मैंने बताया था कि you know maybe शायद आप सांग the title track. But everybody is so excited. I am so excited. I've been looking forward for Pathan for so long. And the first song, Besharam Rang, is the everybody knows it's everybody's favorite already. Um, but can't wait to see Shahrukh in action and uh, just hope everybody loves the song. Super, great. <laughs> Okay, so with that we got. Please tell us about your journey. Like you have got till here, and you're so young. Both are like 27 years old right now. That's young. That's young. That's pretty young. That's pretty young. Younger than us. But still, to be there where you are, 27 is a great thing. How did you all do it? Please tell us some story about. Wow, this is a very deep question, guys, and a long one for sure. But I think. You know, with Prakriti and I, we uh, moved to Bombay at the age of 9 or 10. We also have an elder sister, Akriti, uh, who's also a singer. So she was always the first singer in the family. And my entire family moved to Bombay in 2000 and... I don't even... Yeah, 2005, I think. That's when we all moved here. But... Uh, we went to Mithi Bai, I think a lot of people don't know this, but we were just like right opposite here. We finished our junior college and after that we started singing for, uh, you know, a lot of uh, these ads that you see. So I think um, it was actually very important to me because of festivals like this that we would host and we would perform at and you know how a lot of celebrity judges would come. 
we did that you know i we i did think that for so many so many years and i think you know college and school is so important because that's you know your first stage that's when okay. you have encouraging friends you have an encouraging faculty you have professors and teachers who basically put you on that stage because they believe in you i think it's the best place to come out of your you know comfort zone and overcome like that stage fright and i think that's what happened with us uh of course after that we um hustled yeah like you know like just 18 19 year old kids like studio to studio audition to audition uh lots of rejections lots of failures lots of bad days lots of waking up and just going like nahi yaar ye nahi karna hai kyunki i think when you choose a creative field like this i think anybody who is a creative person um you're going to have the highest amount of highs like today is a high cuz you know we played our song and we have lovely people like you cheering for us Because it's a pleasure having you, having you here. So coming on to it, so this is this is like a big song with Bart Shah. So how was the experience working with Bart Shah? Like he's a lot of our favorites. So yeah. please tell us how yeah. he's like and how was your experience? It was amazing. I think uh, if there's one feeling that we all share when it comes to Bart Shah is that we love him. Whatever he does, whatever music he makes, and you know I think as an artist he's that one artist who keeps reinventing himself. Yeah. Like I feel like he works so hard for his audiences, which also includes us. Like he'll always give us something new to have fun with. You know. And I think the best thing about him, according to me, is that constant hunger. Yeah. You know, वो feeling है क्या number one song we had then when is the next one that's coming that's also number one you know he's never at ease he's never at rest he's he never feels like he has it all he just wants to keep doing keep releasing and you know he every day works at his art every day i think he makes a song hum jo sunne ko milte hai wo bahut kam hote hai but i think because i know him i feel like every day he's making a song and uh, that's the most important journey you know what people like and what people don't like is up to them but i think as an artist he's winning Yes, one of the biggest problems in the industry when people come around is that they don't know the people they are working with, right? Yeah. But you both were like the day from the day one. You both were together when it started. So how was it like? Like how was it experience like working as twins? Always having having someone uh, yeah. someone else to be with. How was it? It's been amazing. I feel like me and Prakriti keep talking about this all the time. It's so amazing to have a support system. Like she's my best friend. Like we grow up together, we work together. We also fight sometimes. But you know, mo like more importantly, like we've always like when we decided we were about fifteen, sixteen, we were like, "Yehi karna hai." We're gonna make this happen somehow or the other. Uh, we dropped out of college, like after maybe by we dropped out, and I think that was the time uh, at around 2014 or 2015. Uh, we went for um, a, a, a world tour with Ankit Tiwari. Um, then she did her first Bollywood song ever with him. It was in this movie called Alone. It was called Katra Katra. The same year, I had another Bollywood song. It was in Dil Dhan Apne Do with. Um, Uh, it was called pehli baar with anushka and ranveer so when this happened when we were in college everybody was like oh you have a song in a movie i was like yeah it just happened like you know we were just like meeting people and going from one studio to the other and a lot of times it was like hum ga ke ghar aate the and a senior singer would come and sing it and we would get replaced and we were so okay with it because i was like obviously mera koi na hoga kisi bade singer ka hoga <laughs> so it was just like that i i think once that tag came oh you're a bollywood playback singer now then we were like oh but like how do i get the second song now i have no idea <laughs> like i literally don't know but, but i think it's just very comforting to have somebody from your own family in the same profession i mean aisa kuch plan nahi tha to be because we were you know pitted against each other also humne ek ek dusre ke khilaf auditions bhi diye hain ek gaane ke liye that has also happened but i think uh, when instagram gave in the picture we got so much support as you know we were like super team practically then a lot of people loved us together so much that they kind of coined this name called silver yeah. and going forward we started getting so much work as to it so i think it's i mean i want to thank all our audiences and listeners for putting us together as a brand i don't think it was our idea ever but having said that now that we make music together um, it's just so much fun and i just hope to share so much more music in the coming year that's a new year resolution <laughs> Give me what I hear with some.
some more amazing songs out there. So you guys have come around from an era where there were a lot of many singers to look upon to. Yeah. A lot of different styles. Yeah. So what was your biggest influence or biggest favorites like? I think when we were growing up, so how old are you all? Wow, amazing. So, does that still qualify in 90s? No. <laughs> okay, so I think, like, when I think both of us started enjoying music, it came from a place where, uh, you know, indie pop was really big. Like, when we talk about Lucky Ali, when we talk about Shan, when we talk about Alisha Chinoy, they have music videos. Shan, you know, so many people, they had music videos and they were just, you know, musicians putting their like pop music out. I think that's what really inspired us. That's what we actually always wanted to do. But then I saw band I don't know if you all have heard band Bandu Boys tonight. Of course, right? Yeah. Nice. You're <laughs> really young guys. <laughs> but there was another band called Viva, okay? This has come on channel V. And our biggest dream was to like grow up one day and be a girl band. Yeah. We couldn't audition to be because we were not 16 years old at that time. But I think Pele in the 90s music videos used to be everything. Then of course it was, you know, films and just Bollywood music. Now I feel like music videos of course coming back, so cannot be happier to Yeah, because this. when in the early days when someone used to hear that there's a new song. Yeah, for this song. <laughs> What's your name? Jignesh. Hi, Jignesh. Hi. Okay, so this song, there's so much actually to talk about. Yeah, ek to like two girls who have come from Delhi to Bombay to just make connections and one day like to just know Bacha as an artist to a friend was a journey in itself, right? I think the day, this is a little bit of a trivia behind the song, but the day Jignu released is when, uh, you know, we met Bacha and he's just that friend in our life, we keep playing different songs too and he's always telling us that this is a good thing, this is a good and you know, different things like that. That's the first day we played him this little tune of Kyasi that he had, that's when we played him the song and um, he said that forget everything else you're doing, nothing's gonna work, this is gonna be that song that's gonna stand out. And I remember very clearly he called this song a clutter breaker because he was like, Ye kuch alag hai. it doesn't sound like any other song. So when he says something, of course, for us it's like Bible. Matlab, sun lo, samaj lo, and just go with it. <laughs> Little did we know at that time, like this song will be with him. So this is like the biggest trivia. Like, I think 10 days later, he called her and said that, she sent it. Another 10 days after that, he was like, I think I'm going to write on it. <laughs> so that's how this whole thing came about. Then yeah, we went to Chandigarh. Then we went to Chandigarh and he has a studio there. Then we sat and uh, we recorded the song at 2 a.m. to 3 a.m. Dancing or singing while you record the song? You dance while recording the song. Otherwise, your pitch just goes for the song. Elvis did it. Elvis did it. But uh, it's, I mean, how many of y'all, like any musicians here, any singers here, any dancers? Recording to easy air. You, you get so many different retakes and you know, um, it's still just your voice. Nobody is like recording how your face is looking while you're singing. Yeah, that's it. This is the guys can also 